guys, welcome to the vlog. So here is a vlog of us going through IKEA and Moa and Joyce. So when I went into IKEA, I didn't really expect there to be like these showrooms. So they had these showrooms where everything was fully furnished and you know, you can see how things pan out if you were to buy their items. La lang, it was just a cute place where, yeah, it felt very homey in a sense, it felt very IKEA. So, yeah, it's very fun to look at. So, I think a thing that I didn't expect was that being in the showrooms felt like being on a film set. So, if you're younger, I guess, do you know like the Nickelodeon or like Disney Channel scenes of like their house, their home supposedly, or like these sitcom shows such as New Girl or How I Met Your Mother, Big Bang Theory, like that, right? It felt like being on the film set where things were like someone's home, it was settled in, but at the same time, it still felt artificial. I don't know. It was fun and weird at the same time. It was a bit of a geek out factor to me. So, yeah. Look at this kid said <laughs> What? What do you mean? Oh beautiful and Yeah, I think it's like you know the cool thing about it was like the attention to detail. By attention to detail what I mean is like the fact that there's some toys laying around, that there's these pictures drawn by the kids. I don't know, I just feel like I haven't seen it that much in other showrooms. But it added like this sense of like touch of like playfulness or like wonder to the place of it being like a kid's room, you know? So the next part of IKEA that we stumbled onto was IKEA for business. So they had this place here of like a nail salon, a cafe. It was pretty cute. and taking Orville with us in like through the stuff toys and stuff we decided to leave the place but the problem is while doing this we didn't realize how big the area would be for us to find the exit so I don't know if me and Jana took the wrong turn or something but literally we spent like 30 minutes just roaming around this place filled with shelves curtain lights everything like 30 minutes just trying to look for the exit because we didn't have much much money to spend and like you know we're young so there's nothing to renovate but still like so much time just to find the exit it was pretty fun but at the same time it was like a maze it was like alice in wonderland but you know it was pretty fun too so after walking a bit we reached this light section i highly recommend you guys take pictures there because it's pretty aesthetic food court and even ate dinner so yeah that's the event here <laughs> So then 
after eating, we just went around the mall. The mall was about to close anyways. And yeah, we just went back home after that. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Ring the notification bell, but only if you want to. And remember, no diving, no pushing, no shoes inside the pool. I'm just joking. See you guys!